Lancinol breast pads and storage milk bags, a little sample of that. A little gender neutral passy, which is so sweet. A little itty bitty thing of Aquaphor, which this is gonna be great for diaper bags and stuff like that, so you don't have to take the whole thing. I love these little trial sizes. Um, it also came with this really cute kind of wristlet bag that came with um, a newborn diaper, some wipes, and then just some Pampers coupons. So that's really neat, and this will be another great thing to just throw in the diaper bag. It's a really cute print, like look at that, I love it. And then, and a Target bag, just again, tons of coupons, all sorts of things. So I really loved this little gift from Target. I thought it was really nice. Okay, so that is what I got in the gift bags. Hey guys, so this is actually going to be part two of my 17 week bump date because I just left some stuff out and some of you guys were asking questions and I totally need to address them. So let me just start with one thing I completely left out of my bump date yesterday that I said I was going to add from my daily vlog and that was the little gift bags and stuff that I had gotten from Motherhood Maternity and Target. So, cause it's really neat and it's something that I wanted to share with you guys. So for Motherhood Maternity, it came in like a plastic bag, which I already threw away. So I'll just show you kind of what was in it. First off, there was this Avent bottle and it's pretty nifty. I like it, little, yeah, like that. And then it also came with a jar of the new beech nut. It's real, it's some baby food stuff and it came with a little jar of honey crisp apple baby food. If you hear that really annoying squeak in the background, that would be my dog. I'm really sorry. So yeah, I got that. And then it came with just a bunch of coupons for literally all sorts of things. Um, a $20 gift card to Shutterfly, which is amazing. And um, yeah, basically just stuff like that. So that was neat. And then from Target, first off, it came in this really cute bag, which I love and will definitely be reusing it. And then in that came the new Munchkin Latch Bottle, which this thing seems really cool. It has this little nozzle right here to prevent um, colic and stuff like that. I guess it gets the air out. It's pretty neat. So that was exciting to get. And then it came with some... Also, I wanted to say that I am so sorry that the daily vlog I did the other day... So this is hilarious. I recorded all day Thursday, and then I edited it Thursday night, and I was exhausted Thursday night. And then I uploaded it to YouTube and went to bed. So <laughs> I didn't even see the daily vlog live. You know, live. I mean, like, I didn't watch it till the next day after I'd already put my bump date up and I realized that there was a whole like four minute clip at the end that was just not on YouTube. It was on the video that I edited because I remember editing that clip. Um, it, I must have hit delete like literally right before I exported the video. So um, the video actually did have an ending to it where I was like, hey, yeah, I, don't, I was like on Pinterest looking at baby things and then I was like, okay, night guys, I'll see you tomorrow, blah, blah, blah. So I actually did have an ending to that. It didn't just end randomly in the one that I edited, but of course it came up like that on YouTube. So I'm sorry about that. I promise the other ones will actually have a true ending to them. <laughs> I just feel like such a knucklehead. I don't know if I'm having extreme pregnancy brain or what my deal is, but sorry. I'll make it better next time. Okay, so another thing that I wanted to talk about is that a bunch of people, like lots and lots of people, have asked for a house tour, which I am totally going to do a house tour, but right now our whole upstairs is in just mass chaos, which you can't really tell from this room, but so we have four bedrooms upstairs, three are used as bedrooms, one is used as like a man cave room, um, but now that we have the nursery started, Basically, that room's furniture is going in this room, this room's furniture is going in the man room, but right now it's just all jumbled up between rooms because everything needs swapped out and we just didn't have time yet. So everything is a disaster upstairs. 
but I promise within the next, I would say month or so, I will have a house tour for you guys since everybody wants to see it. So sorry I can't do it right now, but I'll do it soon. Also, I have been asked what my workout routine has been or is or whatever, and honestly, until this past week or week and a half, I guess, I haven't been working out except for just going on walks, um, which I should consider that working out, but I don't really. That's just like a leisurely thing to me. Um, but I have started some videos that actually Cassidy from It's Me Cassidy, she talked about them when she was pregnant. I can't even remember what the name of this YouTube channel is. I'll link it below if I can, um, if I remember. But basically they're like prenatal workouts. And I do one that's their arm workout. It's pretty intense. Like if you get five pound hand weights, it's 10 minutes of like constant doing stuff. It'll work your arms out. And then I also do the lower body like butt and leg one. And I really like it. So I've been doing that and then on top of walking and just, you know, like the normal stuff. Um, but that's pretty much been my workout. I'm so excited to actually get back into working out and feeling that muscle soreness again, which sounds weird. But I mean, when you're used to feeling that and working out all the time, it feels so great to get back into it. It was just, I was too scared, honestly. I... I was just worried that I would do something and something bad would happen, but now I feel very um, just secure in this pregnancy and I'm to a point where I just am in a good place and I feel comfortable working out again. So yeah, I'm excited about it and like I said, I'll try to link those below for you guys if you want to see them so you can kind of see what I'm doing at home. But that's pretty much it that I wanted to tell you guys. So sorry this is like a random little update, but I had to say these things because I thought I would forget by next week. So I hope you guys are doing great and I'm thinking about you and praying for you all and I will talk to you soon. Bye guys.